Crazy Days, a longtime shopping tradition in Bemidji, will go on this Saturday despite some previous controversy. Uh, Brenda Mack goes downtown for the details. Deals, deals, deals. Crazy Days will return this year without its longtime sponsors. This is one of the most important days of the year for us and for all the downtown businesses, the people coming, they expect it, they look forward to it, they plan for it all year. Though the event is still two days away, many merchants have already begun sales. It'll be store-wide on everything. It just seems like the enthusiasm in downtown Bemidji is over abundance. Today I was driving around and there's not it's hard to find a parking spot in downtown Bemidji. The sidewalks are full of people. The Bemidji Downtown Alliance decided to no longer sponsor the event due to a decline in business participation. BDA tells Lincoln News that because their budget is derived from BDA members, they want to make sure they are marketing and meeting their needs. First, we were all, I would say, a little upset maybe, but um, we all came together and we all still um, did a huge ad, especially in the byline. The the main difference with this year's Crazy Days is streets will not be closed down and rather sales will be out here on sidewalks or in store. Previous years, the BDA had a blanket insurance policy for this event to close the streets. Okay. So the merchants still required individually if they have something on the sidewalk. Yeah. That, um, that they would have that insurance. But tradition lives on. For many, Crazy Days is more than just sales. It is a community gathering. I'm super excited for it, actually. Yeah. We don't compete. We all like to be friendly with each other. We have a great relationship next door with least of these and down the street as well. So I feel like it's really cool that we can all come together and do something and still put on something for all the tourists in town and the people of Bemidji. BDA's president tells us she wishes participating retailers well. BDA says it is working with businesses on community event partnerships like the Summer Music Festival to keep downtown Bemidji alive. Yeah, yeah we'll have, we'll have to make a trip down. <laughs> In Bemidji, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. Some retailers are hoping BDA will return next year as its main organizer. Crazy Days will begin at 7 a.m. on Saturday. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.